Oh, you said it was banging real hard back in the 90s. It died there because all the OGs got killed and went to jail, you know what I'm saying? So then there was a, a free for all, you know what I'm saying? The city really feel a lot of Crips, those GD, you know what I'm saying? The Bloods, the Bloods is out here, but the Crips ain't the city in the early 90s. They had all the drugs, you know what I'm saying? The drug game traded. That's, that's when, the, you know what I'm saying? When the niggas got a hold to the work, that when, you know what I'm saying, you was able to run the city, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what, that's why I was at the stranglehold in the city, niggas, the drugs, you know what I'm saying? But it ain't more of, it's not banging no more, man. They kill you over anything these days, you know what I'm saying? It was about colors until about 96, 97. Now, you know, I'm me. The community, Arkansas, is not as bad as people say it is, man. You know what I'm saying? If you're in the wrong mix, just like any other city, you're in the wrong mix, then you're going to get what you get. So, you know what I'm saying? I got plenty of families in the streets, and I got plenty of family that, you know what I'm saying? How can I say this? That's in the goddamn corporate world, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm good on both ends, you know what I'm saying? So, I feel as though, I don't feel like, oh, it's all bad, or when we go out or nothing, it's good, but if you're in some bullshit, then you're going to get bullshit. The game is so crooked, man, crazy, man. Everybody, everybody want to be out the way. Gangs to commercialize now, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Having the second with the, the, the rap gang got nigga what they, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers ain't trying to go to college, man, or open their own businesses or hunt with that. They want to be a, a sack total. So it's like the media, TV, and internet fucking up everybody here. <laughs> Not just that, man. What, what's fucking up everybody here is the home, man. You can't blame a motherfucker outside your house for your house. That's true. You know what I'm saying? That's it's the true. home, man. It's our mom and dad in the community, man. Grandpa and grandma put some on a nigga's ass, man. Praying for a nigga at the same time. Smoke pole. Yeah, you gotta put some on a nigga ass, pray for him at the same time. That's what the Bible say. Smoke pole. Everything else is unnecessary, man. So I ain't blaming TV. I ain't blaming the internet. I'm blaming mom and daddy. That's real. That's real. So no guidance, none of this. Hey, man. And if you ain't got no respect for home, what you gonna do when you go outside the motherfucker? You gonna be a terrorist, man. Niggas don't want to work hard. Niggas don't want to grind. You see, you see niggas coming up so fast. For instance, I got a cousin that's doing double life. He ain't never gonna get to touch his son again. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But at the time when he was doing what he was doing, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna open up no cases. He was up, and everybody in our family was gravitating to him. But now it's like, damn, he's gone. He ain't gonna get to see his kids. You know what I'm saying? The only time he's gonna ever get to see see, see this is if, if one of his parents died. You know what I'm saying? So it's just people gotta grab the concept that. Hard work pay off. And it's hard. It's all about being self made, and people gotta wanna grind and get the wheel. You know what I'm saying? Me and P. Smooth say this all the time. If we knew what we knew now, four years ago, yeah. man, we'd be having this conversation and a goddamn one of my condos or something else, but you know what I'm saying? Time waits for no man. So what we know, we just take and run with it, man. Keep grinding, keep going forward. You gotta have the right people around you. Once again, if your people with the shit, they can influence you. Come on, man, this is what we on. And you know what I'm saying? I had them people, but I saw a, better, a bigger picture. So I put myself around people who was trying to get it, who was about that grind, but in a legit way. And we had the same dream. So you know what I'm saying? You gotta have the right team around you so you can come for some things. But if you with them niggas that's with this shit out here, this city here, oh man, I done seen it, I done seen it take a lot of niggas. For real, for real. We losing them motherfuckers like daily, man, you know? It's hard to stay safe around here. That's why you gotta keep family around you, man. You know, somebody you know, ain't snakes, man. It's a lot of snakes in the city. So why you think, like, you know what I'm saying? Shit's so crazy, man. A lot of violence and all this. Snake shit, man. Like, man, hey, motherfuckers don't wanna uh see you get no money. So. They be like, yeah, bro, let me shop with you. Let me go fuck with you. Put the pistol on you. So you're a lady? For what? And you gonna go spend that money on a hoe? You be broke, like, come on, motherfucker. Niggas that's jack don't never keep their money. Yeah. Every nigga that no check. Yeah. They stealing, they stealing. You can't, you can't get bonded out. They stealing. Oh, snitching. That's why they ask that. They gotta do big time when they snitch. Regardless if you snitch, you don't do some time, fam. Regardless if you snitch, you don't do some time. If you stealing, then that ain't a million dollar lick. You did wrong. If you stealing, if anybody ain't watching the DVD, man, Jack Boys, whatever, you stealing shit, and you ain't got a million dollars when you stole it, you fucked up. Nigga still a quarter of pounds and shit. What the lick. fuck you look like, man? Get you a motherfucking job, man. Go to ITT, nigga. Yeah. Motherfucking support, man. Let's just show love. Let's come out and leave the bullshit at the crib. 
let's come out and, and actually try to dance on the females and try to interact with the females, get to know each other. Let's see what's, what each other got going. Like, just give off positive energy. Like, I was telling my cousin, uh, shout out to Emory Jr., by the way. I was telling him the other day, it's like, when you go to the mall, I see all these young niggas just want to walk around and be tough. Like, for what? Like, who, who you trying to impress with? What do you got to be tough for? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, niggas don't want to crack a smile and... I feel like if I could change one thing, it'd be some love. Just love and support, that's it. Everybody so you feel like the streets gonna get better one day, though? Oh, uh, yeah. No, it's gonna be better because, it's, it's better, it's, like I said, the crack ever did. You know what I'm saying? They can't trick us with the projects no more. They can't trick us with nothing. It's over, with, nigga. I see. The black mind is different, man. We got real deal Cola Pals and Barack Obama's and Oprah Winfrey's out here now, man. So niggas is, you know. We doing something else. We doing something else. Hey, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna tell y'all one thing. Like, like, these kids ain't raised how we was. I'm an '80s baby. You know what I'm saying? My grandma with my ass was fucking sweet, double tied. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these kids ain't got no guidance these days, man. You know, like my bro said, these kids ain't got no guidance, man. You know what I'm saying? Only thing we can do is encourage them, get us some guidance. You know. So it's just some real nigga shit, man. You know, I'm gonna keep saying my name, Trey Bands. Just like keep a clear mind, get your mind, see the vision a little bit different. You know, it's different. Get some money, get a bag, own your own shit.